Hello everyone, I am the Ron and Only, and there's nobody I'd rather be, and welcome back to part 23 of my Let's Play of Pokemon Legend Darkest for Nintendo Switch. Last time in part 22, we journeyed from here in the arena's approach, down here uh, to this bottom corner of the map, uh, then round we went all the way to the top to the snowfall hot spring and find ourselves creating the ice peak camp when we which we, we probably should have gone this way first and then gone to the camp and then explored the rest but we did it the opposite way around because i was an idiot but anyway uh today we'll be doing just that we'll be going finally to the, the here to meet garrick of the pearl clan so let's where is it go this way and let's go meet with this guy. Why does he have his shirt off in the frozen ice? Well, that was a real slog. Fighting through those miserable icy winds to reach this, this desolate bit of nowhere. Well done, us. This gentleman is Avalug's warden and my most honourable teacher, Garrick. So show some respect, Adaman. Let's begin with some proper introductions. I am Garrick. I serve as one of the Pearl Clan wardens. And you must be Rolly, right? Of the Galaxy Team. Answer me this, would you? On what grounds do you come here seeking to quell Lord Avalug? He's... in a frenzy. That leads to my next question. What is wrong with him being frenzied? It could trouble others. I have another question. Setting aside any orders, what, is your heart tell you, what does your heart tell you to do? To quell his frenzy? <laughs> Our mighty lord of the tundra, Avalug, has done nothing to trouble any person or Pokemon. Sir, please try to keep your cool. For now, indeed, Avalug's causing no trouble, but aren't we also duty-bound to free other, our people from living in fear that such a colossal Pokemon might begin to wreak havoc at any moment? We are. There's certainly some logic to that. But if that is what you hope to accomplish, then we must judge whether this child is up to the task. Who cares about the grandstanding? Let's get to battling. Let's start. Fine then, I'll prove it. My musculature... My musculature is as hard and unwielding as ice. Think you can break through? Let me guess you use ice Pokemon. What a surprise! Uh, Electrode. Probably not a great idea for you to come out. Oh, and, and a Frost Lass. Uh... Teddy, let's go. And we'll flame throw the both of them. Clay goes down first, easy. Unless Frost has level 24, so oh. I thought I had like both 48. That would have been that would have been a challenge. Nice. Battle decided. Good job, Teddy. Outstanding. I'm tough as an iceberg, but you smashed me through and through. I burnt you with a flaming doggo. <laughs> I suppose you could all get on with, with it now. This is one's all right. Thank you, sir. Some may still have their doubts about a stranger like Ronnie, but I'll vouch for him. Then if you insist on quelling Avalug's frenzy, you want to claim some of the eternal ice he likes and bring it to my lord's seat. Good luck. Eternal ice, is it? For that, we'll have to be able to fly, which means you'll need braviary. Long story short, you're going to seek out a young lady named Sabi. Tell me the long story. Tell the long story long. You're not saving any time if we waste it puzzling out what you mean. Isn't Avalug one of the Pearl Clan's lords? Seems a bit odd for me to do the talking. But fine, listen up. The, this eternal ice stuff can be found atop Avalug's legacy here. But to get here, but, get to, but to get there, you'll need my clan's help. Not even Sneezer can climb this surface, let alone a person like you or me. You're going to have to approach by air with Braviary's help. Gary once managed to climb up nearly to the top of the Avalug's legacy, I'll have you know. He says he made it to within six feet of the top. M might makes right, or at least height. And uh, about Sabi, how do I put this? Even when she's not flying with bravery, she's got her head in the clouds. Well, you'll understand once you meet her. Head towards Snowpoint Temple and you'll probably come across her sooner or later. Wow! Sobby!
My clairvoyance told me that I'd lead you on my chase. B think you can reach me? I see what you meant by Hulk Sabia, but why would she be up there? So you better focus on pursuing Warden Sabi and let me focus on my workout while I still can. How do you have your shirt off in this frigid ice? Your nipples must be like freaking hard as rock. Uh, so how do I get up? Oh, I guess I better go up here. Or I go round here. Okay, there we go. And Braviary. Hello, my name's Sabi. She's tiny. Nice to meet you, Ronnie. Uh, same to you. I've heard about you. You're super talented, right? I bet you're going to be fun to play with. I know why you're here too. You want bravery as help so you can quell Avalon's frenzy, don't you? Well, you'll get it. If you can catch me first. Let's go, Braviary! I got a racer. Catch up to Sabi. Where has she... She's all the way over there. Jeez. Back to the way we came. I bet you ten pounds. She goes down like this, and then she goes round to get back up to the Snow Point Temple. I bet you like ten dollars. I like bit like ten pounds. Like why has she gone all the way over there? Anyway, there's a wisp flame over here. Ooh, and there's a sparkly thing over here. Hey, B Barrel. Ooh, Stardust and some snowballs, nice. And that's at the end of the path of that we've been oh we've been here before, so I know. There's Sabi. Huh. Quite up to you. Ronnie! You made it all the way up here in this cold. But the question is, did you catch me or did I let myself get caught? Hmm? Oh, and one more thing, am I even really clairvoyant? Uh no idea. Hmm, no one but me could really know, right? Anyway, the challenge continues. Next stop of our merry chase is Snowpoint Temple. But the real question here is, am I really having pl fun playing with you? Or am, I, am I bored? Hmm? Let's go, Braviary! So now I've got a race from the bottom of the map. All the way to the top of the map? She did this on purpose. She did this so on purpose. So now we've got to go all the way up there. So what, we going to, what I'm going to do... Is we've got all this left to, uh, area left to, uh, to explore. We've got all this area left to explore. So what I think I'll do, if I zoom in, I think because there's that cave back there. There's a part of me thinking we go this way, this way, across this way, this way, this way. So that's what I'm going to do. Uh, we're going to head here first. Uh, once I figure out how to get down. Uh, okay. There's a time-space distortion over here, so I think we'll go actually go through it. On our way. So let's go... Ooh, there is an alpha above the snow right here, so... Let's try and catch it. Big boy. Big boy. That worked. Level 68 of Bomber Snow. Alpha Bomber Snow. Snow Core. Okay, any shards here? Uh, no, clearly he wants to fight though. Come on, Space Distortion. Anytime now. Here we go. Right, let's go. 
Whoa, sizzle. Okay, I'll fight you. Uh... Hang in there, Teddy. Ultra Ball, let's go. Nice, caught. This is always caught. Wait, there's one. Ooh, Electivire. Uh, and an Eevee. Uh, Electivire. Let's go Electrode then. Evolution of Electa Buzz. Pure electric type, I believe. Energy Ball should not knock it out. Goes for a Thunderbolt. Eevee's gonna do double edge. Hang in there, Electrode! Uh, in which case, let us change to. Teddy. And then can I also attack? No, just. Do you get paralyzed by Electivire? Let's go Gigatumble on the Electivire. Nice. And that just leaves the Eevee. Uh, anything I have is loan my attack. So what I'll do is I'll do a crunch and see what happens. Excellent. Okay, into yellow. Goes for double edge. I'm a rock type. Just hurts itself. Uh, and we'll go for an Ultra Ball. Nice. Another EV to my pack. And Electivire. Don't think so. Oh, Espeon, though. Yes, please. Um, we'll go for a very weak fire fang. Nice. And elective buzz goes for thunder. Ow. This one goes for calm mind, which in the long run is not great. So we'll go for an ultra ball on the espion. Nice. Oh, no, come on. That should have been one and done. Electabuzz Buzz still going for those Thunder Punches. Goes for Mimic. To learn Fire Fang? Uh, okay. Let's go Ultra Ball. Nice, we caught the Espeon. Okay, Electa Buzz, let's finish you off with a Flamethrower. Strong style. And down goes Electa Buzz. And we caught Espeon, yay! Don't have to worry about evolving that one into one of my EVs into it, so that's great. If, any, if more uh, Eon Pokemon, uh, Evolutions could show up. That'd be much appreciated. Pokemon I want to catch, actually. It's Hisuian. Uh, Rufflet. Who wants to fight? Okay. Uh, I've chosen the wrong Pokemon maybe to fight you. We'll find out. I wonder how you evolve into Raviary. Go for that Thunder Wave and then Ultra Ball. Let's go. I think it becomes a Psychic Flying type. 
Ruffler added to the team. So it might be a good idea to catch a... Catch a Ruffler. Oh, there's another one. Hey! Goes for a double edge. Ow! That hurt. Why'd you do that? Okay, Ultra Ball. Nice. Okay. Looks like there's more Ruffler up here. So let's go... Can we go up this way? No. Okay, Snoozer is. Statue thing. Oh, hello! I went up the wharf. I was going up the wharf in Basque Legion then. There's a statue? What's this statue of? Oh, there's an unknown back here. Unknown you? I think it is. Whoops. Uh. Unknown? There we go. Unknown you. This weird statue. Is it supposed to be a golem? Hmm. Weird. Use weird sneeze sneezler. I even don't like the name sneezler. It could have been better. Could have been better. Okay. There's a lady over here. Oh, this is the Pearl Clan. I finally found them. Coming all the way out here to visit us in our cold home. Even Rina must have heard doubts about how best to lead the Pearl Clan. So this will be one day Snow Point City. Which is kind of neat. What is that over there? Have to find out later. Let's first go f uh, meet, go through the Diamond Clan, uh, the Pearl Clan even. Meet with everyone here. What is space around me? Is mine? My big, my space is bigger. It's so big and. Oh, even the kids have... I like the hats. Cleaver and the other noble Pokemon watch over and protect us humans. Well, Pokemon like Ursaluna let us ride them and take us as far away and cross the Hysteria region. But did you know that these Pokemon are all descendants of the ten companions of the ancient hero of legend? I did not. wonder what else is around here. They say Almighty Snow watches over us from somewhere beyond the skies. Ambit. And Ingo is unbelievably good at battling the Pokemon, don't you think? I mean, it's like his knowledge about Pokemon is on a completely different level. Some Pokemon can actually be very affectionate towards humans. They live and grow together with us and even protect us from wild Pokemon. After changing to history from across the sea, our ancestors met Almighty Sinnoh in this place. That is why the Pearl Clan decided on this location for our new home. So Lord Avalog may not have much, not move that much. He keeps his Pokemon in check and watches over the safety of our settlement. If we didn't have Pokemon to help us, there's no way we could survive in this frozen land.
What is at the top of the Pearl Clan? Let me. I'm gonna, that's what I'm going to find out. Aww. Move. Move. It's right now. It's why not? They're enjoying the hot spring. That's so cute. That's adorable. There's some um, crunchy salt as well. I think there's some stuff up here as well. So let's go over here. But that's cute. Little swine I've been enjoying the hot spring. And the pillow swine. And I need to go up there anyway, so... But we're going to go the long way round. Maybe another long episode, but that's what we're gonna do. Ow! Let's. We're back at camp. So let's go this way. And into this cave. Let's see what's up here. See what's in this cave. Oh, just a wisp and loads of um, stones. So that's cool. Nice. Very nice. Okay, so now we're going to go up this way. So maybe I haven't then. Okay. Ow. Into the mist we go. Ah, an another Hisuian Zora. Okay. But no Hisuian Zora arc. Nice. There we go. Well, maybe his Zora Rock appears in one of these caves then. Friggin. Ooh. Alpha Sneasel. Nope. Evolve that into a uh, into our own Sneasler. Okay, let's go up the trail we're supposed to be going up Ooh. to get to Lake Acuity. Not Verity. I, that was the other. That was the other lake. Okay, so many steps I can go up then. Not all of them interesting. Why make steps I can't go up? 
Well, we finally reached Snowpoint Temple, so let's quickly... I think, as, as much as I want to go up there and talk to her uh, and, and get Braviary, I think what we'll do is we'll save that for next time. Uh, it's taken us a long while to get all the way from down here to Lake, to the Snowpoint Temple. So I think we'll save the Snowpoint Temple and Avalug's uh, mission over here for next time. But we have, look at all how much we've covered. There's still this area in the corner down here that I don't think we can actually get to. I think it's going to be like that stupid fog going to set in, like, oh, you can't go this way. Um, but we have gone oh, through the eternity. It's taken us a, a, a good long time to go through all of the Alabaster Islands, and I think we'll be covering the last end of it in the next part. So join me in part 24 when we finally finish up the rest of our missions to do in the Alabaster Islands. But for now, at the Snowpoint Temple, let's try and get a good shot of it. That'll do. I have been the one and only, and there's nobody I'd rather be, and you've been watching part 23 of my Let's Play of Pokemon Legends Arceus for Nintendo Switch. Don't forget to give a like, comment, share, and subscribe for more, and don't forget to ring that bell to be notified of when my next part will be uploaded. And I'll see you next time, trainers.